Want to learn what type of retirement communities Las Vegas has? Well, that's what I'm talking about today, and I'm starting right now. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Angela O'Hare, your favorite Las Vegas realtor. And welcome to my retirement series. And in this series, I talk about all the retirement communities in the Las Vegas Valley uh, or Southern Nevada. This is part two of my series. Part one, I talked about all the Del Webb retirement communities in Southern Nevada. And now I'm gonna be talking about all the retirement communities just in Las Vegas. Las Vegas alone has about 11 retirement communities. Uh, Henderson has about seven and North Las Vegas has three. So we have a lot of options for those of you who are looking to retire here in the Las Vegas Valley. The choices here are endless. There's about 25,000 homes for 55 plus retirement communities. And that is a lot of choices. Henderson alone, I mean, Henderson has a lot of retirement communities. Summerlin has four retirement communities, which will be part of this series. Um, and I also did a separate video for all of the Summerlin retirement communities. If you're interested in learning more, I'll post a link about them down in the description below. I'm just briefly going to go over all the different retirement communities in Las Vegas. I'm not going to go in great detail about each of them. Hopefully one day I'll do a video of each of these retirement communities. But right now I just want to give you a list of all the different options there are out here in Southern Nevada. So the number one Las Vegas 55 plus retirement community, and this is not an order as which one's the best, it's just an order as how I created this list. That's how I do most of my top list. It's not one's better than the other, it's just how it came in the list. Uh, so it's probably more alphabetical than anything else it is. And then I'll add the Summerlin communities at the end. And the number one community is Los Prados. And Los Prados is in the northwest side of the valley, and it is a gated community built by U.S. homes between 1986 and 1998. Home prices are in the low 200s to mid 400s, and there are 1,358 homes in this community, all of which are resale homes. Number two is Promenade at the Meadows. Promenade at the Meadows is another gated community, and it was developed between 1988 and 1990. Home prices ranges in the mid 200s to mid 400s, and there are 188 homes in Promenade, all of which are resale. And number three is Quail Estates, and this retirement community was developed between 1988 and 1993. Home prices range in the low 100s to high 100s, and there are 216 homes in Quail Estates, all of which are resale. And number four is Rancho Las Brias, and this community was developed between 1990 to 1996, and home prices range in the mid 200s to the mid 400s, and there are 180 homes in Rancho Las Brias, all of which are resale. And number five is Silver Canyon, and Silver Canyon is a condominium retirement community, and it was developed between 1996 and 1998. Home prices ranges in the mid 100s to high 100s, and there are 155 homes in Silver Canyon, all of which are resale. And number six is Silver Spring Sterling, and this community was developed in 1999 to 2003, and home prices range between the high 100s to the mid 200s, and there are 269 homes in Silver Spring Sterling, all of which again are resale. And number seven is Solera at Stallion Mountain, and this is located on the east side, and this is a Del Webb community, which I went over in my series one, but I'm gonna go over it again because it is in Las Vegas. And this is a gated community developed by Del Webb, but built by Pulte um, in 2005, and home prices ranges are in the low 200s to the low 300s, and there are 838 homes in Solera, all of which are resale homes. Now I'm going to go over the retirement communities in Summerlin. I've already done a video on this, but I'm just going to go over briefly these retirement communities so that this is all in one place, all of Las Vegas retirement communities. Again, stay tuned 
to my other series. Series three, I'm gonna go over the Henderson Retirement Communities and North Las Vegas Retirement Communities. Initially, I was gonna make this into a four-part series, but it looks like I'm gonna be able to make it into three parts. So anyway, here are the Summerlin Retirement Communities. Again, not in any particular order, probably in alphabetical order. And the first retirement community in Summerlin is Regency. And Regency is built by Toll Brothers and is one of the first retirement communities in Las Vegas by Toll Brothers. And it started being built in 2016 and there's still new construction um, going on. I think it's about maybe 80% occupied now. Home price ranges are in the high 400s to the high 900s. And there are 434 homes in Regency. Again, some are resale and some are brand new. And number two is Sienna by Sun Colony. And this was developed by um, Sunrise Colony Corporation between 2000 and 2006. And it is a guard gated community. Home price ranges are in the mid 200s to the low 1 million. And there are 2001 homes in Sienna, all of which are resale. And the number three Summerlin Retirement Community is Trilogy. And Trilogy is developed by Shea Homes. Uh, it started being developed in 2018 and there is still new construction. Um, they're more like townhomes, condominium type homes in Trilogy. Very unique style, very modern. And home price ranges are in the mid 400s to high 600s. And there are 354 homes in Trilogy, all of which are either under construction and there are some resale homes in there as well. And the last retirement community in Summerlin is Sun City Summerlin. And Sun City Summerlin was developed by Dell Webb from 1989 to 1999. And the home price ranges are in the mid 200s to the low 1 millions. And there are 7,779 homes in Sun City, all of which are resale. Um, again, the point of this video was not to go into great detail about each of these retirement communities, but to give you some type of education as to what type of retirement communities are in the Las Vegas Valley. If you're thinking about buying a home in any of these retirement communities, you can always give me a call at 702-370-5112, or I've posted a link to a buyer form down in the description below. If you have any questions or if I missed any retirement communities in the Las Vegas Valley, leave a comment down below. As always, if you like this video, be sure to hit that thumbs up button, leave a comment down below, um, share this with a friend, and subscribe to my channel if you're interested in learning everything and anything that this awesome Las Vegas Valley has to offer. Thank you so much for watching today. I'll see you guys on the next one.